Hello, everybody, and welcome to high school volleyball for the 2016 season. I'm Mark Bixler and Bixler Video Productions. Glad to be with you. This is opening night of Prairie Land for these two schools, Farmington and North Fulton. Farmington enters tonight's game at 1-2, and two, North Fulton at 1-5. and five. We're going to take a quick break, and we will be back with more of our pregame show here in Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoon River Animal Clinic, compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. REMAX Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WVYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church, to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions. If you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. And we welcome you back to Farmington Central High School, where the Farmington Farmers, playing host to the North Fulton Lady Wildcats, the Farmington Lady Farmers, and we'll run through the starting lineups. First off, for the visitors from North Fulton, of course, North Fulton, a co-op of Spoon River Valley, and Cuba High Schools. For the North Bolton Lady Cats, right back will be Paige Fanestock wearing 18, the right front, Megan Platt wearing 24, middle front, Sydney Bocott wears number 22, the left front, 51, is Lindsay Harold, left back, Kenzie Patch wears 25. And the middle back will be Lexi Hanlon wearing number 33. The libero for North Fulton will be Madeline Harrison. For the Farmington Farmers, right back will be Haley Halls. The right front, Morgan Powell. Halls wears number one, Powell number seven. Middle front is Megan Worley, number 14. The left front will be Julia DePriest wearing number four. Left back, Abby Brown wears number six. And the middle back will be Megan Gilstrap. She will wear number 11. The libero for Farmington will be wearing number nine, Mackenzie Peckham. The libero for North Bolton, as we said, is Madeline Harrison. She will wear number six. Cassandra Goff is the head coach of the Farmington Lady Farmers, while Valerie Schnock is the head coach of the North Fulton Wildcats. As we said, North Fulton, the visitors entering tonight's game at one and five, while Farmington enters tonight's game at one and two. We'll take another break and we'll be back with the opening serve of this, our first volleyball game of the year in just a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North 5th Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver. By Canton Napa, located on North 1st Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design, with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes, with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool, located on Avenue A in Canton. By M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. And we welcome you back to Farmington, and we're just seconds away from the first serve of this opening game. This is the 
sixth game for, or the seventh game, I should say, for North Fulton, and the fourth for Farmington, the first Prairie Land Conference game for both squads. As in the ball game now is uh, Hannah Street Matter, as she will be the libero. I said Mackenzie Peckham would be. That is incorrect. Hannah Street Matter is actually the libero for. Farmington. Paige Vanisok with the serve, and it'll take us a little bit to get the names, and that's going to be a side out and point for Farmington as they take a quick 1-0 lead in this match. This is a game that we've done pretty much every year since we've started videotaping. Harrison with the up, and the dink across was... Again, Platt, a nice placement, but coming up with that was number 25, Kenzie Patch, and outside hitter down the line. Harrison gets that as that hit was by Morgan Powell. And that's going to be a side out and point for North Fulton, and it's a 1-1 ball game. And it looks like we have a substitution coming in as Kelsey Thurman enters the ball game. She replaces Kenzie Patch. Platt set the serve. Nice serve picked up by Street Matter. And they'll free ball it across. Harrison with the up. And Harold on the attack. It's picked up by Farmington, though. They get it across, and that drops. Little miscommunication between Harold and Thurman. And that'll go as a point on the side out as we. I've been doing rally scoring, which means there's a point on every serve. That's going to be an ace. So a point for Farmington, and they lead this 3-1. to one, As That was Morgan Powell that came up with that ace. She will serve again on the jump serve, and it is picked up, and Platt gets it across, and Hanlon with the roll shot. That attack goes long. That was Megan Worley, and that is a side out. No, check that. Looks like we're going to have somebody in the net. And the point for Farmington. So they lead it 4-1. to one. Hanlon. Harrison, rather. And on that attack, I didn't see who got the block, but it was a block, and it is a point for Farmington. And they lead it by four right now at five to one. Opening set. Harrison with the up. Nice block by Street Matter, but Harold in the net. And it's a 6-1 lead for the Farmers. Timeout taken by North Fulton, so we'll take one here as well. We're still in the first set. It's 6-1, Farmington over North Fulton. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoonerver Animal Clinic. Compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. REMAX Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WBYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church, to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions. If you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. Set to resume play as Powell with the jump serve here and gets another good one in the up. Hanlon um, getting it across the net was Sidney Bocott. With that on the attack, Worley on that attack and 
into the net. It drops on the Farmington side, so that is a side out, and it makes it a 6-2 ball game. Peyton Peckham checks in, and Renee Mance checks in for North Fulton, and she will serve. A four-point lead for the Lady Farmers. Street Matter with the up, and on the attack, the roll shot, that was Jocelyn Taylor. Peckham, or Street Matter, rather. Free ball it across. Let's see whether North Fulton can turn it into the attack. They do, but a nice up. Haley Halls. And that will be a point in the net. Lindsay Harold. that is the second time she's been caught. Both officials calling it, so... Seven to two now the lead. And that serve is long and it will be a side out. Play to 25. We're still in the first set. Farmington taking the JV matchup. Played just before this game. Harold with a serve and that is long. Checking in to play across the back row will be Cassidy Collier for North Fulton. A five-point lead now for the Lady Farmers at 8-5. to five. With the serve, it is Sophie Hemp. Hanlon on the attack. And that will be a side out in the net. I believe guilty of that was Megan Gilstrap. Makes it a four-point game again, eight to four here in the first set as we will have a substitution for North Bolton as well. Kenzie Patch back in the ball game. She will serve at the underhand and tell you what, you're not used to seeing those. That is a point and it's a three-point lead. Most people serve overhand at the high school level. And a nice placement, point, a two-point lead. Eight to six, Farmington. This is our first volleyball game, our first chance to see both of these schools. And that is going to be a point as it goes off of Sophie Hemp. And we will have a substitution as... Julia DePriest coming in to replace him. That one is picked up. And they'll take it across, and it goes right into the block. Paige Fanestock, but she didn't get up across the net for the block, and it falls on the North Fulton side. So a sign out, a point. Abby Brown serving now for the Lady Farmers. They lead it by two at nine to seven. And that is a net serve. So a side out in point and North Fulton again within one point. Opening set, nine, eight Farmington. All right. The Priest wasn't expecting Street Matter to drop. It was a little too high for Street Matter, and she let it go by, and the priest couldn't get it up cleanly. Street Matter does get that one up. Cross, Collier with the up. And a nice dink, but that'll be a side out as the momentum carried Sidney Bocott. So a side out and point. We were tied. Now it's a 10-9 lead for the Lady Farmers. Gilstrap set to serve. Goes to the corner, but a little wide. So we're knotted up at 10 apiece. As Lindsay Harold checking in, she'll replace Collier.
Vanistock serving. That one is the up. Worley. A little wide to the right, and North Fulton takes their first lead at 11-10. Vanistock set to serve again for the Lady Cats. And a little tight, and Bocott with the kill. And the lead is two now at 12 to 10 in this opening set. Bannett Stock set to serve again. Yep. Peckham, or Halls rather, gets it across. That was a nice up by DePriest. They do get it across on a free ball. See if they can turn it into the attack. Harold, the block. Worley credited with that block as Harold going for the kill. Side out and Farmington pulls to within a point at 12-11. North Fulton with a big rally. Let it at one time. That rolls across. It'll be a point. We're tied at 12. Farmington led it at one time 8-3. North Bolton rallied and took a 12-10 lead, but right now we're tied at 12. That's going to be a point. Right on with the serve, I believe. That is Haley Halls. She is serving well. Three points in a row to... Give Farmington the one-point lead again at 13 to 12. Halls again with the serve going deep, but Harrison wisely lets that go, and we're tied at 13 on the side out. Set to serve is Megan Platt for the Lady Cats. Good serve and gets the ace. North Fulton back in front, 14-13. Platt again with a serve. That up, Powell, Halls, a long attack, Worley, and it's a, si a point, and the lead for, Far uh, for North Fulton back up to two at 15-13. And that rolled off of DePriest. They will get it across on a free ball going deep, and it is out. Side out. Uh, check that a point. As North Fulton will maintain their serve, leading at 16-13. Back after with this timeout, back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you this event Monocle's Pizza, located on North Fifth Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver. By Canton Napa, located on North First Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design, with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes, with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool, located on Avenue A in Canton. By M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. Back in Farmington, North Bolton with their biggest lead of the match. Three points. Farmington has led this by as much as five. Powell with the up. Holes with a set. Well, dink it across as that was Jocelyn Taylor. Bocott on the attack, but the up by Street Matter. And the block back at Harold. Nice job. They do get it across. Good rally. And then the attack and kill. Megan Worley. A side out and point for Farmington. They're back to within two at 16-14.
That's going to be a point as Harrison playing it cautiously went for it. I'm not sure that might have been out, but it would have been close, I think. That's where the back, the player behind her has to communicate with her. That is an ace. Morgan Powell has rallied with three point, uh, two points off of serves. Of course, they got the side out point. And another ace. Farmington back in front at 17-16. Powell again set the serve. A jump serve. Picked up and early on the attack and gets the kill. Farmington back up by two at 18-16. Each team gets two timeouts and both teams has used uh, they have used one. What a nice up by Hanlon and another kill. Is that up? A little too tight on the net and Worley gets the kill. Three-point lead. Six points in a row by Farmington, and that's another ace. 20 to 16, and Valerie Schnock wants to take a timeout. We'll take one here as well. Farmington leading it by four. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoonerver Animal Clinic. Compassionate care when needed most. IV, your employee owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington with locations in Canton and Farmington. Remax Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WVYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church, to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions, if you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. Back in Farmington, Morgan Powell set to serve. They lead it by four, Farmington does, 20 to 16, and that serve is long. Well, the timeout by Schnock served its purpose. Peyton Peckham checks back in for the Farmers in place of Morgan Powell, and set to serve will be Renee Mance for the Lady Cats. i say that timeout served its purpose because that disrupted play and across the net on the set I believe that was the priest or holes I'm not sure who was getting the set right there but the back to back points pulls North Fulton to within two at 2018 and that's nice up they I thought it was going to be an ace but they got it up Hanum Hanlon rather I'll get it no oh, Worley will try to dink it across but a lift is called and that pulls North Bolton to within a point at 20 to 19. We'll see how this shakes out as Farmington was the first to 20. That is a net. Well, I will say, and, and it, it hasn't changed, but I do not like, because on a serve, I, I you give an unfair advantage to the offense when it hits the net. That is a point because the ball changes what happens when it hits the net. And that's an unfair advantage to the offense. I say, and that's going to be a point, a side out, and we're tied at 21. I've said this for years. Go to what tennis does. And that is have a net serve. You reserve it, and if you hit the net again, it's a side out. Mm -hmm. 
Worley set to serve. And that is picked up. I believe that was Hanlon. Harold on the kill gets it. And that gives a side out and a point to North Bolton. And it's 22 to 11. Lindsey Harold serving again. Picked up. Street Matter holes with the bump set. Mance, and that is picked up off of the roll shot. Worley on the attack and gets the kill. Tied at 22 with that side out as checking back in is Cassidy Collier for North Fulton. Set to serve is Julia DePriest. Priest goes for that corner. It's picked up, and that's going to be a point. The up off of the serve, and a little too tight on the net. Crossed it, actually. The Priest serves into the net. Side out. We're tied at 23. And we've got an exciting one here in set one. Side out's taken, and she's not telling where she wants the serve to go to. I had flashcards. And that is out. Oh, yes, good call. That is a side out and point. So Farmington will have set point number one. Abby Brown in the game to serve. 24-23, the Lady Farmers. Brown serve. Picked up, and that's going to do it. So the Lady Farmers, in a thriller, takes set one here from Farmington, 25-23. We'll be back with the start of set two here from Farmington. As the Lady Farmers win, as we said, in set one over North Fulton, 25-23. Back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North 5th Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver. By Canton Napa, located on North 1st Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool located on Avenue A in Canton. By M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. And we're back in Farmington, ready for set two to get underway. North Fulton on the floor. Farmington making their way back out. We talked in that first set. Valerie Schnock, the head coach of uh, North Fulton, giving, uh, holding up her, her dry erase board, volleyball dry erase board, uh, giving the signal where she wanted her server to put the, to place the ball. I mentioned that I use flashcards, and what coaches do is they'll have the right back is position one, right front is two, three is the middle front, four is left front, five is left back, and six is middle back. They'll have on the numbers on a flashcard or they'll hand signal or right down on the flash, and that is going to be a two hits against North Fulton. So Farmington takes a quick one to nothing lead off the first set. Haley Hall serving four of Farmers, but they'll write on a flash card. I had flash cards one through six, and I'd hold up facing the server where I wanted it to go. That is out. So a side out as Madeline Harrison lets that go. As checking in is Kelsey Thurman. 
And she replaces Kinsey Patch. Platt with a serve. Holes to Powell. And in the net, North Fulton. They've been guilty of that quite a bit tonight. And it gives Farmington a 2-1 lead off the side out. Powell set to serve. She had some good serves in that set number one as Harrison and Worley. As that was tied on the net. Vanistock replacing Harrison. The libero. Powell with a serve, and they go short that time. And again, this time it gets across, but went deep. I think that was Hanlon. It is a side out in point, though, as Farmington unable to come up with that cleanly. So a 3-2 lead now for the Farmers, the Lady Farmers, as the Lady Cats, Renee Mance, set to serve now for the Lady Cats. Mance, the serve, picked up. The Priest free balls it across. Platt with a set to Harold, and that is going to drop. It's a point, and we're tied at three. In set number two, Farmington set, took set number one, 25 23. North Bolton, one and five on the season. Farmington is one and two. No free ball. Actually, Roll shot it across. Harold picks that up. Platt sets the ball to Hanlon. On the block, DePriest picks it off. And with the block, you that does not count as a hit. That could have easily been two. DePriest goes after it. Fanestock the up. Platt to Hanlon. Dinks it. And it's out. So a side out. And that gives Farmington the lead again at 4-3. to three. Worley checks in, replacing Street Matter. Of course, you don't have to do the rotation with the libero. You just come in. Worley. It's a little bit of a jump serve, not totally. Flat to Harold on the attack, and that is going to drop a side out. Harold gets the kill. And we're knotted up at four. Harold set to serve now for the Lady Cats. The Priest into the net. Point. North Fulton leads it now 5-4. to four. They are down one set to none. It's a best of three. That is a point, an ace. Six four North Fulton. Harold with a serve. That could have been a lift, but not called. Uh, and and I've never understood this, and uh, officials never have really been able to give me a valid answer why they let that go on a serve, but they don't on an attack. Well, that's going to be a point, and it's an eight four lead, and. Cassandra Goff is going to take a timeout. North Bolton by four here in set number two, trailing one set to none. But here in set two, it's North Bolton eight, Farmington four, back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoon River Animal Clinic, compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. REMAX Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WBYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church to know Christ and make him known. 
and by M. Bixler Video Productions. If you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. Back in Farmington, 8-4, North Fulton leading Farmington. Here in high school girls volleyball. Peckham with that up. DePriest on the attack. That is deflected. It's going to be a side out and point. Five, eight to five. North Fulton leading it as checking back in is Sophie Hemp. Hemp with a serve. It's picked up by Collier. Platt. Hanlon on the attack, and that's going to be a kill. Side out and point for North Fulton. And that is why that's a tough place. She signaled two. As I could see exactly what she's doing, she doesn't do it on the dry erase board. She just gives a hand signal, Valerie Schnock does, and she signaled two, and that's a tough one. Tough location for the serve. That was Vanistock with the attack, but it was deflected, and that a double block. Worley, or Gilstrap rather, it's it across. Hanlon goes deep on the attack, and it's long. So that is a point. Uh, Farmington draws to within two at nine to seven here in set two. Brown with the serve. It's picked up by Mance. A set goes to Gilstrap, and it's deflected out of bounds. Point. Farmington draws to within one. Nine, eight. They trail it against North Fulton. Brown set to serve, hoping to tie this one. Nice serve, but long, and it will be a side out and point. Sydney Bocott checking in as Emma Hanlon. Excuse me, Lexi Hanlon. I'll get it right. Street Matter with the up holes. And that is going to be in the net. And that's got to be a part of the game that Valerie Schnock is not very happy with. Ten nine North Fulton. Hillstrap with that hit. Fanestock the cross court attack, and that's going to be tough. But they do get it across on a free ball. Let's see, and they free ball it back across. Tried to place it, and that is what happens when you free ball a b free ball back. That was one area that I really, when I coached volleyball, would girls volleyball, I would get upset with my young ladies when we would free ball a ball that had been free balled to us. That is in the net. Because a lot of times it ends up with the other school getting an attack. Right now it's 11-10. Farmington trailing North Fulton here in set two. We've got a good one. Harold on the attack goes long. Was not deflected. So it is a point. And we're tied at 11 here in set two. Farmington took set one in a thriller, 25-23. We've got another good one here. Madeline Harrison with the up. As that was Kenzie Patch. And that is going to be a point. So North Fulton back up by one at 12 to 11 as Megan Platt set to serve now for the Lady Cats. That's normal serve, I guess you could say. And Hall's got that too tight. Cross the net. Harold 
puts it away, gets the kill. Two point lead for North Fulton, 13-11. Harold, same thing, and in the net, on the follow-through, good call. You got to snap, but get it back. You can't follow through. She did get the net. So it is a point, side out and point. Farmington back to within one, but... Morgan Powell, who's had some good serves, not necessarily on that one, and it's back to a two-point lead for the Lady Cats. They lead Farmington 14 to 12. Renee Mance. Well, they'll get another point. The lead is back to three. And Cassandra Groff taking her time out, and I think that may be her last. At 15 to 12, not wanting to take a chance. We'll take a timeout here as well. North Fulton by three, 15 12, back in a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North Fifth Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver. By Canton Napa, located on North First Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool located on Avenue A in Canton by M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. Back in Farmington, Cassandra Goff taking her, believe it was her, fi yes, her final time out. Not wanting to let this one get out of hand, but at the same time, you do have a one set to none lead, but she wanted her girls play getting a little sloppy and Wanting to put an end, and they'll free ball it across, and it did not cross in front of the antennae, so it is a side out and point. So Farmington draws to within two at 15 13. Whirly. With a serve, Harrison with the up. They'll free ball it across, and that was borderline, but Hall's deciding to take it. They'll pin it to the corner. That could have been a double. Harold, Hall's with the set. We're, uh, check that gill strap goes long. Side out and point, and North Colton back up by three as Lindsey Harold will be serving now for the Lady Cats at 16-13 North Fulton. Harold serve is picked up by DePriest. It's up by Gilstrap. Free ball to cross by DePriest. Hanlon on the attack. It's blocked by Gilstrap. Deflected, I should say. And then Gilstrap gets the kill. Side out in point. Farmington draws to within two at 16-14 as Cassidy Collier will check in for Harold. The priest set to serve. Farmington down by two. Collier with the up. Tied on the net. Gilstrap says, not in my house. You put it that close, I'm going to hammer it. Timeout taken by North Fulton, their first. Farmington draws to within one, 16-15 and set two. Back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spooner Animal Clinic, compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. 
the Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. REMAX Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WVYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church, to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions. If you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. Welcome back to Farmington. Farmington leading at one set to nothing, but trailing here in set two, 16-15. We've got another good one. They took set one, 25-23. That's going to be an ace. We're tied at 16. That time, the timeout by Schnock not getting accomplished. So as a result, she'll do a substitution as Emily, Emily Lee Johns checks in. Replacing Collier. Johns with that up. Platt, they'll free ball it across. Halls to Gilstrap, an ace. Farmington retakes the lead. Collier going back in. I think she just, uh, Valerie, Coach Knock just wanted to talk to Cassidy, but at the same time, that used one of the rotations. And you're only allowed so many rotations a game. DePriest serves nice pickup by Collier. Hanlon goes long. 18-16 as another substitution. Addison Williams checking in. Trying to stop the bleeding right here. DePriest. Collier with the up. Platt the set. Hanlon. The dink blocked across by Gilstrap. Farmington will return it on a free ball. Fan of stock. Hanlon now on the attack. The block and it drops on the Farmington side. So a side out. And the lead is one. Farmington with it right now at 18-11. I believe that is Williams with the serve. Nance with that up. Williams the set. Hanlon into the two. A double block. It falls on the Farmington side. And we're tied at 18. Williams set to serve again. Williams going deep. It's long. And Farmington... With that side out point on rally scoring, retakes the lead at 1918. Browns with a serve. Oh, looked like it might have gotten an ace, but Millstrap returns it. Williams sets to Fanestock and falls on the Farmington side. Point. North Fulton with that side out. Bocott checking in. She'll replace Mance. Hanlon set to serve for the Lady Cats. And that is a point. North Fulton retakes the advantage at 20 to 19. Well, now if you're Cassandra Goff, You've used your timeouts. The lead is two, 21-19. Hanlon set to serve. Street matter, a dink by Powell, and that goes long. And now if you're golf, you, you almost... She's already used two. Good 
heads up play though she started to take the time out the referee said no but that did kind of disrupt play a little bit side out 22 20 kind of disrupted things enough that it they were able to get a side out Gilstrap serving for the farmers Collier with the up Fanestock dinks it across Bill Strap the up, Hall sets. That was Whirly. Bocott, and that's a side out point. 23 20. Fanestock set to serve. North Fulton down by a set. But leading set two, Street Matter. I believe that's Powell, or Hemp, excuse me. Panastock, Williams, sets the ball to Harold. That is deflected point. Set point for North Fulton. A chance to even this up at one set apiece. Panastock serve goes long. 24-21. Harrison back in as she'll replace Fanestock. Haley Hall set to serve for the Lady Farmers. Down by three here in set two, but leading it one game to none. Halls. Harrison with that pickup. Well, a, a nice dig out of the net, and Halls will dink it. Harrison with the up. And across. The net was across the underside, or foot went across, was Harold. So it is a two-point set, 24-22. Harrison with the up. Williams sets it to Harold. Nice pickup by Brown. And that is a nice attack. Williams with the bump set and the miscommunication. <laughs> Megan Platt coming in. Madeline Harrison was going for it. Harrison hesitated just enough when, ha when Platt made that move, and it drops. 24-23, North Fulton still by one over Farmington. Back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North 5th Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver by Canton Napa, located on North 1st Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design, with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes, with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool, located on Avenue A in Canton. By M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. Well, it's perfection, and thus far, Farmington has had it. 24-23. They still need another one to send this to overtime. Williams sets the ball to Bocott. Picked up. Poles with the set. Worley. It is out. And a point. I think it was the right call, but this is where I would really like to see Illinois have the schools provide, each team would provide a line judge. One calls the lines, the other calls the sidelines, the other calls the end lines, and each school provides one, uh, two. And I think you would, I, I do believe he got that one right, but it was very close. And we've had 25, 23 scores in both of them. 
And I believe the teams will stay in the same position. So my guess is North Fulton won the toss and will serve. And Farmington gets the decision what, well, it could be, let me rephrase that. Farmington won the toss and will serve. North Fulton gets the decision what bench to sit on. And I, I'm going to, if I'm a betting man, that's what took place. But we'll have to wait and see until the start of the third set. We're going to take a break. We're tied at one set apiece. Farmington taking set 125-23. North Fulton taking set 2, 25-23. Back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoon River Animal Clinic. Compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. Remax Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WBYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions. If you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. And we welcome you back. Set 3, just about ready to get underway. And what I said before the break is exactly what happened. Farmington won the toss, chose to serve. And North Fulton then gets the choice what side they want to play to defend. And they chose the same side. And here's why. That's the side they won on. Everybody talks about how superstitious baseball and softball players and coaches are. I'm here to tell you, volleyball is just as superstitious. Haley Hall set to serve. That is picked up, and that is going to drop. Now gets the kill, and Farmington takes a 1-0 lead. Friday night, we'll get our first chance to see the Farmer Farmington Farmers in football as they'll host Rushville Industry. That is wide. Uh, Sidney Bocott on the attack, and it's a 2-0 lead for Farmington. Well, I have to wait and see because I'm never sure whether that's a played to 15 or played to 25 in set three. Well, that's going to be a kill. Lindsey Harold goes up for the attack, but then kind of just pushes it across. I don't know, it's not a push, but it's I mean, it's a legal hit. A dink probably would be best. Platt set to serve, picked up. The Priest, Brown. Free ball to Worley. Williams picks it up. Platt sets the ball to Harold. She'll dink it across. Could have been in the net again, but not called. Harrison with the up. Boycott, Bocott, rather. That's picked up by Brown. Tied on the net. They kiss it out. And in the net was DePriest. It was close. But I think I did see the net move, but I wasn't sure if it was because the ball hit it or if a player was in it. And probably both. Street Matter with the up. Holes with the attack. And a nice place by Worley. She changed direction. And the side out gives Farmington a one-point lead at 3-2. to two. We've had a couple of thrilling sets thus far. Each one ending in 25-23 to 23 scores. Farmington winning set one. North Fulton winning set two. Hanlon with the up, Platt with the set. Harold goes on the attack and the block. It's a point. 
Farmington up by two right now, four to two. Powell set to serve for the Lady Farmers. Picked up. Williams, Platt with a set, goes to Harold and that is a point. Schnock, she knew exactly where her players should be. That was a misrotation. Player positioning foul that was called against farming to, uh, against North Fulton rather. She knew who was to be where. Most coaches know, and that uh, across the net. Cole stepped across the net. It's a side out, uh, under the net, I should say. Mance will serve for the Lady Cats, trailing by two, five to three. Peckham with the up, hauls to Worley, places it. Harrison as they'll free ball it across. Street matter to Halls. And get it into the block. And a nice attempt by Worley off of the block, but unable to chase it down was Jocelyn Taylor. So that is a point for North Fulton, and they're within one at five to four. Taylor, and that is going to be a point. Side out. Farmington up by two now, six to four here in set three. We're tied at one game apiece. Worley serving. Harrison with the up. Worley, the up, or check that, that was Gilstrap, and that's going to be a point. So the lead is three as Harrison couldn't come up with it. And it's seven to four, Farmington. Harrison with the up. Hanlon off the deflection and that's gonna be a side out. Point for North Fulton as Fanestock will come in to replace the libero, Madeline Harrison. Harold will serve for the Lady Cats. And that's in the net. Side out point. Three point lead again. Cassidy Collier back in now as she'll replace Harold. Hemp set to serve for the Lady Farmers. Williams with that up. Mance as Williams places it, free balls it across. Worley, check that, Gilstrap. That's all the one. Thought it was a four, but not, and it's a four-point lead for Farmington again at 9-5. Hemp set to serve for the Lady Farmers. Collier with the up, flat the back set. Hanlon off the deflection, picked up. Street matter, they'll free ball it across. Gilstrap, Hamance with the up, set by Platt, and in the block, Hanlon, but it falls on the North Fulton side, but out of bounds. So a side down and point. A three-point lead for Farmington. North Fulton set to serve, as that is Addison Williams. Street matter with the up. Gilstrap, three balls it across. Collier, Williams, Banistock on the attack. Picked up by Hemp, it's a cross. Addison Williams. Hanlon will free ball it back across. Let's see if they can turn this into attack. A roll shot by Gilstrap, and she'll go for the kill and gets it as the return was to the Farmington side. And the lead is now four at 10 to six. Powell back in and set to serve is Abby Brown. And that is long. Side out and point. Farmington still with the lead, though. 10 to 7. Hanlon set to serve. It's on the way, and that is going to be a point. An ace 
Hemp overplayed that one. Came a little too far. And kind of time serves kind of move a little bit. They're knuckle balls. And that's going to be a point on the kill. 10-9. We'll come back. We'll recap this one. It's been a good one all the way through. Whoever wins this is going to, it's not going to be easy. That's going to be two hits. That's a point. Or a lift, I should say. So the side out and the point for Farmington extends it back out to a two-point lead as Gilstrap's had to serve. It's 11-9 Farmington. Gilstrap. And that's going to be an ace. Three-point lead, 12-9. Obviously, we're playing to 25, I'm guessing, at this point. Bill Strap again set to serve. Hamlin with the up. Williams back set to Fanestock. Dinks it across. Halls. Worley with the kill. 13-9. Bill Strap set to serve once again for the Lady Farmers. They lead it by four. Bill Strap serve. That's an ace. 14-9 point. Farmington leading it by five. North Fulton taking a timeout. We're tied at one set apiece here in set three. Farmington 14, North Fulton nine. Back in just a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North 5th Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver by Canton Napa, located on North 1st Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design, with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes, with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool, located on Avenue A in Canton. By M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. Back in Farmington, a five-point lead in set three. We're tied at one game apiece, 14-9 here in set three. Farmington. Williams gives the ball to Bo Bocott. Stink to cross. That's going to be a kill. Megan Worley with that. The lead extended to six at 15 to nine. That answers the question of what, <laughs> whether we play to 15 or to 25. Excuse me. Gill strap set to serve. Cassidy Collier. Nice up by Hemp. And it is dinked and in the net, North Fulton. Gilstrap serving again, 16 to nine. She has been on a roll. Williams with that up flat, throws it across. Well, didn't throw it literally, but I mean, gets it across. That could have been a double. Placement. Hanlon. Williams, they'll have to free ball it. They do. Holes. And out of bounds. Side out. But the lead had been extended to 16 to 9 with that side out. It makes it a six point ball game at 16 to 10. Fan of stock. That probably would have been long. It's a five point lead now. North Fulton down 16 to 11 to Farmington. 
Vanistock serving. Hemp, Street Matter, free balled by Worley. Harold goes on the attack, picked up by Brown, and that's going to be a point. That's tough when it gets up into the rafters and kind of rattles around. And you've got to judge where it's coming down, and sometimes it comes down like a rocket. Well, that one is long. Holmes hit the serve for Farmington. They lead it by five again. It's 17-12. That picked up by Hanlon. The up, Williams, goes outside to Harold. Down the line, and that's a side out and point. 17-13. If you're North Fulton, though, you can't trade. Now that you've kind of dug yourself a little bit of a hole. But with rally scoring, it can change quickly. Point. Eighteen thirteen. The lead back to five as Morgan Powell set to serve for the Lady Farmers. Williams with that up, Platt sets the ball to Harold, and that is long. The lead back to six at 19-13, and Valerie Schnock elects to take her second time out, not wanting this one to get away. We're tied at one game apiece, but here in set three, Farmington leading it over North Fulton, 19-13. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoon River Animal Clinic. Compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. Remax Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WBYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church, to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions, if you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. Back in Farmington, a six-point lead for the Lady Farmers in set three. The winner of this set takes the match. Williams with that up as Harrison. They'll free ball it across. They do get it across. Platt to Bocott. And that is in. That was close. Uh, that was extremely close. I would have to watch that on video. That is long, though. Well, you make the decision to let it go, or do you go after it? And sometimes you... Make the wrong decision. That's a net serve. 21-14 now with that side out. Farmington just four points away from claiming their second win of the season. Worley as Hanlon with that up. Platt sets the ball, goes out to Hanlon, dinks it, gets the side out on that kill. Doesn't matter how hard it is. It's a dink or a attack. It still goes as a kill. Six point lead for Farmington as Harold set to serve. 21 15. Street Matter, the up hall, sets the ball to the priest on the roll shot. Point. 
Well, they say it didn't get across. I thought it was blocked. I thought I saw contact, but between the officials and myself, I'm the only one wearing glasses. So well, that is going to be a point. Now, this is where Cassandra Goff has not taken a timeout. I might take a timeout right here just to stop the bleeding, to keep them from taking the lead. Now, I might not have right there, but if they score another one, I probably would. Street Matter with the up, Gil Strap, thinks it across, Platt to Hanlon, they'll free ball it across. Halls with the up. Nice placement by Gilstrap. Williams to Hanlon on the attack. Picked up by Street Matter. Halls sets the ball to Gilstrap, and it is wide. Out. That is a point. Now I probably would take one. You're within three points. You've got both of your timeouts. I probably would take a timeout right here, but that's me. Peckham. Holes with the back set. They go wide. Oh, they save it. Harold, they'll free ball it across. Let's see what they can do here. Holes. Out on the attack, picked up by Platt. Williams with the set. Panastock, the deflection by Gilstrap. And that is off of a block. It's out of bounds off of Panastock, I believe. So that is a side out. Well, Coach Goff plays through. Not a bad decision. I probably would have taken the timeout when they got to within three. Holes. And that is a point, a kill, Gill strap, and the lead extended back to five. Well, it's now or never. DePriest set to serve. Williams. Hanlon with the dink. Placement. Mance. Uh, Platt. Hanlon. They free ball it across. Not seeing a lot of attacks. Now we get one. And that is a kill. 23 19. Williams set to serve, a five-point, uh, four-point lead, rather, 23-19, as we said. Street Matter with the up, holes, back sets, and that is wide. 23-20. Now she wants to take it, and now she's going to. 23-20, Farmington leading this by three. After leading it by as much as seven here in this final set, North Fulton draws to within three. Back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North Fifth Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver. By Canton Napa, located on North First Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool located on Avenue A in Canton. By M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. Back in Farmington, a 23-20 lead for Farmington as Williams set to serve. It's picked up by Hemp. Holes with the back set. And in the net. Banastock, they have been guilty of that all night. And that's a part of the game. You want aggressiveness on blocks, but you've got to be aggressive under control going on, going for blocks. 
Just match point. Vance with that up. Williams, Vanistock, thinks it. Hemp with the up. And that gets across. Platt with the up. Williams sets the ball back to Hanlon. That's a point. Well, North Bolton has to have perfection. At least for three points in a row to keep this one going. Any missteps, and Farmington claims this match. Hanlon set to serve. Brown with the up. No free ball it across. Platt, Williams, now Vanistock. Point. 24-22. Now remember, Farmington still has one timeout left. Now I would take it on the next one. Hemp with the up. Brown. Bump set. Skill strap. Brown to Bocott. The block picked up. Hemp. It drops. Now I would take the timeout. And Coach Goff is 24-23. Farmington by a point. Back to Farmington in just a moment. Helping bring you tonight's game, Spoonerver Animal Clinic. Compassionate care when needed most. hy V, your employee-owned grocery store on North Main in Canton. The Bank of Farmington, with locations in Canton and Farmington. REMAX Traders Unlimited, Susie McMillan, your local agent. WVYS, the voice of Fulton County. Stereo Village, located on South 4th Avenue in Canton. Wesley United Methodist Church to know Christ and make him known. And by M. Bixler Video Productions. If you'd like to buy a DVD, call us. Lexi Hanlon will be serving for the, far, uh, for the Lady Cats. We've had three nail biters. Right now, Farmington leading this in set three, 24-23. Well, we have three straight 25-23 scores. Valerie Schnock can't even watch. Nearly got an ace, and it drops on the farming on the North Bolton side. Boy, one extreme to the other. You nearly get an ace on the serve. They get the up, managed. And it drops on the North Fulton side. 25-23 again, the final score. We'll be back to recap this one as Farmington takes it two sets to one in just a moment. Helping bring you this event, Monocle's Pizza, located on North 5th Avenue in Canton. In Canton, we deliver. By Canton Napa, located on North 1st Avenue in Canton. Innovations Hair Design, with locations in Canton and Macomb. Sedgwick Funeral Homes, with locations in Canton, Farmington, and Bartonville. CD Country, your home in the country. Lambs of God Daycare and Preschool, located on Avenue A in Canton by M. Bixler Video Productions. Interested in underwriting an event? Give us a call. It costs less than you think. And we welcome you back to Farmington. A three-set win for the Lady Farmers of Farmington in a thriller. Farmington taking set one, 25-23 at a set that was back and forth. Then North Fulton in another set that was back and forth. Ends up winning that one 25-23. But in set three, North Fulton 
fell behind early. They rallied. They were able to get to within one point at 24 to 23. But then what appeared to be going to be an ace on a serve, the defender from Farmington able to get the up. And then it drops. Found a way, found a hole in the on the North Fulton side and fell to give Farmington the three set win, two games to one here tonight. Again, the final scores, North Fulton, Farmington taking set one, 25-23. North Fulton taking set two, 25-23. And Farmington taking the finale, set three, 25-23. That'll do it for tonight's broadcast of High School Volleyball with M. Bixler Video Productions. I'm Mark Bixler. A reminder that you can watch these games on Canton Public Access TV, also Farmington Community Access TV, and also on our YouTube channel. We encourage you to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and you'll be able to see when we post new ball games. And, of course, we also post those YouTube games on our M. Bixler Video Productions Illinois page on Facebook. Again, a three-set win for uh, two, set, uh, two games to one win for Farmington here tonight. As, again, Farmington winning 25-23 in set one, falling 25-23 to North Fulton in set two but winning 25-23 in set three. The Farmers improved to two and two. North Fulton drops to one and six. For M. Bixler Video Productions, until next time, I'm Mark Bixler. So long, everybody.